Hey guys, I am back from the midnight release of the PlayStation 4. I am Midnight Strike 3625, but of course you already knew that. And if you've been a longtime fan, you'll probably recognize this webcam that my hand is kind of straining to hold up right now. It is my old Logitech C120 webcam, which I use to film all of my videos in between the dates of, I believe it was May 2012, and of course August 2nd, 2013. So, used this for a very long time. I actually used it for my older videos on my old channel in 2011 and early 2012, so even longer than that now that I think about it. And what better time to bring this out than, if I can put all the stuff over here, than an unboxing of the PlayStation 4 that I have right here and my chair is creaking so please excuse that so i'm gonna prop it up and get, get it propped up right there playstation 4 just picked it up and let's see if i can do this on the floor that's what she said okay so first thing you'll notice is it has a nice handle here so you can just pick it up and it walk out of GameStop or wherever you bought it with style. So we're gonna open it up here. Got a little thing. It's got a little sticker right there. Keep most of the box intact. Sony PlayStation logo. So there's a little tab here you can open up. And the first thing you'll notice about the box itself, well, aside from the handle here is on the back it actually has some games some game promotions actually there's um, Edward from Assassin's Creed there's the character from Knack and um, Watch Dogs over here I can even find it right there and I have no idea what that is probably something from Killzone and of course infamous Second Son and a giant PlayStation logo. So, we're gonna open this up here. And we've got the system. Looking beautiful. Absolutely love it. I'm gonna put it on the chair here. Get a very nice view. Very promising. And the chair spins, so. take it out of the wrapping here I'm trying to do all this one-handed so I may sound like a complete idiot flailing around the camera all over the place like that so this is the PlayStation 4 doesn't it look epic kinda zoom out a bit like that so looks awesome and got a little sleek design here Let's see what else it comes with shall we comes with another controller of course I already had a PS4 controller from when I pre-ordered the second game that I had which is right here Injustice Gods Among Us and I will probably separate this video into two segments one one where I go and unbox the system here because I have to actually, you know, have a movable camera for that. And two, two, when I am unboxing the games because it's just easier to do that un and unwrap the games with two hands. So, you know, I guess you can tell. But another thing that Review Tech USA, huge shout out to him. Thank you so much for this, advising me to download the patch the day one patch for the sony playstation 4 right here so that i don't get onto some clogged servers and you know you know how busy those servers are going to be with everyone going with their ps4 in between the hours of basically midnight you know now and a little bit later during the day tomorrow they're going to be just running completely and utterly slow. There's going to be so much traffic and it's going to be a very, very cumbersome experience. So, USB drive. There we go. Got this thing right here, the controller. Take it out of the wrap here. So you guys can see it. Of course, it's going to be 
exactly like the other one. So, let's see. Take off the little pieces here. It's got some weird sticky tape on it. So, stuff to throw away. Whatever. And last but not least, there is a little manual in here with some instructions. And I believe it has PlayStation Plus somewhere in here. Three months, yep, three months. Or one month, whoops, one month. Ooh, that would, be, that would have been a bad slip. One month, 30 days, try it for, free for 30 days. I already have a subscription because I am a loyal PlayStation Plus follower. You get free games, discounts on games, and just a bunch of other things. And if you have it for PS3, don't bother getting it for PS4 because it carries over. Thank God, Sony. Thank you so much. So, not a Sony fanboy, I swear to God. But I do like Sony better than Microsoft. Quick start guide right here. It's in the little plastic envelope, plastic bag thing. And let's see what's underneath here. Do you get an HDMI cable? Um, not necessarily. You get a charging cord right here. Got the charging cord. And you also get the power cord, which, I mean, it doesn't really matter. I already have one for the PS3. They're interchangeable. And, whoa, I guess you do get an HDMI cable. I already have two of those, but it's always nice to get a spare, especially if it's going to be required. So, good job on that, Sony. I'm kind of looking at the computer screen here to make sure I'm actually filming everything right. This is a very impromptu thing here, so if I say um a lot or stutter on my words, don't hold it against me. Please don't. So, oh, and then we've got a little mic thing here. I think that's what it is. I have no idea. Um, headphones, headset. I think it's a mic. Yeah, I don't know. Either way, I will be playing all the brand new games while everyone else is basically stuck in the P days of the PS3. So, or at least a large group, a large majority of people who want to wait. And this was my choice, and I'm pretty satisfied with the result. Even though there's not that many new games out there, as of right now, well, more on that is to come. So without further ado, let's get to the games. Okay, so now that I'm back to the more stable webcam, I'm going to have to apologize for the poor sound quality in that last segment. It was my old webcam, and I was using the webcam with the speakers from my laptop, so it kind of got a little muddled. But anyways, this is the games portion of my PS4 unboxing slash midnight release getaway go-to thing. And I have two games that I showed off in my pre-release video, Injustice Gods Among Us, which I actually had to substitute for Watch Dogs, because I was initially going to get Watch Dogs, but then it got cancelled and I didn't want to get just, you know, a, just a racing game or a first person shooter or AC4, which I already have for 360, so, I mean, it's, it's one of those things where it's a really hard decision to make because of the lack of games, so I got this, Injustice Gods Among Us, like I said, because I missed out on the PS3 version, and it's the Ultimate Edition, so why not? It includes all the stuff that I would be paying for anyways, so the other game that I got, like literally just today when I got my receipt, I kind of got suckered into it because, you know, I mean, I have no problems with it. I've never played a Killzone game ever before. This is going to be my first one. I know it's a first-person shooter. One on PS2 didn't fare so well, but this, the next two did, Killzone 2 and Killzone 3 respectively. So, I like the cover art, I really like the design, and I'm thinking, you know, that kind of reminds me that Shadows Fall, the metalcore band Shadows Fall, needs to come out with a new album. They came out with one in 2012, I, I know, I know, but, but seriously, Fire From The Sky was so epic, I actually reviewed it on my Facebook, but you know, that's a whole other story. I'm going to actually dig in. I've got a little box cutter I got from work, like I said. Work at a grocery store, so, eh. Doesn't pay the best, but at least I'm paying off all of my expenses, like this right here, and other more serious endeavors, such as college. So, there you go. Wrapping is off. It includes a seven-day trial of PlayStation Plus, even though, as we already witnessed, the PlayStation 4 carries a month so 
basically, I mean, that's that's really all it is, is that and that. I, I really, really miss the physical manuals. I've said this before, I'll say it a million times over and over again. Games should come with physical manuals. I, I miss it. I fucking miss it. Please excuse my language. Alright, now we're gonna open up this other one. See what's inside. The power that's inside Pokemon. Yeah, I had to say that. Okay. So, case. Already unwrapped. And it comes with, well, more than Killzone did. But that's to be expected because it's an, a generation higher, I suppose. And this one was actually a PS3 and 360 game before it was ported. So, boring shit. Nothing about the game, just warranty crap. <laughs> eh, whatever. So, you got this little thing in here. Un Ultimate Edition, music album download. Okay, let's see, what does it have? Sight unseen, rise against, this kid's not alright, AWOL nation, AWOL nation, evil friends, Portugal the man, walk on air, minus the, by minus the bear, wow, that kind of rhymes, angel by Depachi mode, pure war by picture plane, this is, or this is, is, is pain by the faint, well, I don't know, um, beards again, by M S T R K R F T. Weird bands on here. The only one I really know is Rise Against. So, um, Fallen, Jacob Plant, Villain, Killer Mike, um, Refusal to Die by Zeus, and Another Soulmate by Jane's Addiction. Okay, there's another band that I know. So basically, it gives you a free album download right here. So this is the Ultimate Edition of Injustice because it comes with literally everything. So. I picked a great deal with that. So, I am now going to play lots of video games. I actually have homework tonight, too, so... Anyways, I'm signing off right now. Thank you for watching. This is Midnight Strike 3625. Keep calm and rock on.